Hello, YouTube family. Buckle up, because we're diving into the murky waters of international trade. The Panama Canal, the og of shipping lanes, has ruled the roost for over a century. But guess what? There's a new sheriff in town, and it's packing some serious heat. Mexico's Interoceanic Corridor, a $4.5 billion behemoth aiming to rewrite the trade map. Now, the Panama Canal, that iconic waterway connecting the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans, needs no introduction. But wait, Mexico wants a piece of that action? Buckle up, because this is about to get interesting. Before we dive into Mexico's ambitious plan, let's rewind a bit. Opened in 1914, the Panama Canal revolutionized global trade. Imagine the days before, when ships had to sail all the way around South America, adding weeks, even months, to journeys. The canal was a game-changer, slashing travel time and boosting economies worldwide. But fast forward to the 21st century, and the Panama Canal is feeling the strain. Larger ships, increased traffic, and even climate change are putting pressure on its aging infrastructure. So, the question arises, is there room for another player in this maritime game? Here's where Mexico steps in with its bold proposal, the Interoceanic Canal. This behemoth would stretch 300 kilometers, 186 miles, across the Isthmus of Tehuantepec, in southern Mexico. That's almost five times longer than the Panama Canal. But wait, it gets even more ambitious. The Mexican Canal aims to accommodate post-Panamax ships, those bigger than the current canal can handle. Think megaships carrying massive cargo like oil, liquefied natural gas, and containerized goods. Imagine the impact, faster shipping times, cheaper transportation costs, and a potential boom for Mexican trade and infrastructure. The canal could create thousands of jobs, attract foreign investment, and even revive nearby communities. Plus, it could ease the burden on the congested Panama Canal, benefiting global trade as a whole. But hold on, it's not all smooth sailing. This project faces some serious challenges. The environmental impact is a major concern. Building a canal through delicate ecosystems could disrupt habitats and biodiversity. Then there's the hefty price tag, with some estimates exceeding the initial $4.5 billion figure. Securing funding and navigating complex land ownership issues add further hurdles. This project isn't just about economics. It carries significant geopolitical weight. Mexico hopes to establish itself as a major maritime hub, potentially rivaling Panama and even the United States. It could also reshape trade routes and alliances in the region. So, will Mexico's interoceanic canal become a reality? It's too early to say. The project is still in its early stages, facing numerous obstacles. But its potential benefits are undeniable, and the Mexican government seems determined to push forward. But what do you think? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Let's spark a conversation about this ambitious endeavor and its potential impact on the world. Remember, this is just the beginning of the story. As the project unfolds, we'll be here to track its progress, analyze the challenges, and explore the potential consequences. So, stay tuned, subscribe, and join us on this exciting journey as Mexico navigates its way towards a potential maritime revolution.